What is up, you guys? Welcome back to my channel, or welcome to my channel. I'm Deja. Oh! My nails look like this. This is a press on that I made, and it's the only one that won't come off. We're about to get into those today. I am only gonna do one hand. Ugh, bro, I know I'm hot, but damn. Just for like content purposes, post some pictures over on my Instagram. Here that I have in my head, I want to do like a strawberry milkshake type of vibe. So, I think that I do have, hold on. I think I do have the little strawberries. Them is apples. Oh, I got the strawberries in right here. Okay, you know, I'm a little whore for the coffins. Uh, I think I'm gonna do Taper Square today. Don't really know the vision that I'm going for. I know that I wanna do kind of like a pinky, reddy, whitey, swirl you know i did see um you know how like people put the bubbles on their nails i think i'm gonna do that on a couple nails should i plan this out should i map out the nails probably but am i going to no i'm gonna just kind of go with the flow i'm gonna set y'all up i know this is not gonna be like a um a video a nail type of video y'all used to because i'm sitting here rambling and i normally the videos i watch they just kind of the hands already here, but it's all right because I'm not one of them. I mean, so listen, I'm gonna set y'all up and we're gonna get into it now. If I move too fast or like jump cut, jump, jump, jump cut, do not blame me. I really just get very bored while watching stuff and I edit my videos like three different times. Like I do a, a full run through edit, then a half run through edit. It's like it's a process. And like I get bored really fast watching my own videos. So I just want to like crop out stuff that's unnecessary to me. Just watch the video. <laughs> Let me show you guys. This is the press on set that I did yesterday. This is a press on set that I did yesterday. You know, get into the little flower petals. Press on's coming soon. All right, y'all. I don't know if this setup is nice, but it's besides the point. Um, I'm gonna start by prepping my nails. I'm going to be putting on this top coat today and it just allows me to um remove the set when i'm done like i can just literally pop it off i got this off of amazon that's what it looks like and it kind of works a little too good like it'd be popping off while i'm trying to shape and stuff so that's that so i should probably do a set one day on myself or like maybe if i have a client set you guys up and show you how i would do on a real like to do a real set because I apply, you know, the uh, the dehydrator and the primer. I really shouldn't even be doing this right now to my nails. They gotta heal. Like I was before I got the the pillable gel base. Like I was just doing set after set, and I would just like soak them off, and like my nails are like this hand is so messed up. Like it's just the nails look tragic. I really shouldn't be doing this, but I need content for my nail page. You gotta do what you gotta do, you know. Like I said, I really don't even, ooh, that was a close one. Uh, last time I dropped this, I had to get a new drill. I think I just messed it up, y'all hear it? Damn. Damn. I'm too clumsy, shit. So I did break the drill, but it's all right. See how this one sounds? It didn't sound like that when I got it either, but this one actually hit the ground. Is this better? <laughs> I don't know. Let's get into it, okay? So I put the top coat on, I'm just about to size my nails. One day I hope to be good enough to just get things on there, you know? But that's not happening today, what number is this? Hey. If the nail tip doesn't fit you, the nail bed wall to wall, make sure that you always size up and just file. So that's what I'm gonna have to do. I like to take two different files because I like to use this one low key as a buffer because this grade is like, harder than this one this is kind of like soft so i like to take this one around the cuticle area you guys will see when i get into it but i'm gonna have to file down these tips so hold on and you just kind of nothing too major you guys now that i think about it i don't really know if i want to do a strawberry shortcake or a strawberry milkshake set when i'm working over this top coat it takes a glue a little bit longer to dry I really feel like I should probably just be on live doing this. But you know, doing it this way, you guys don't have to sit and watch me do this for three hours. <laughs> Bitch, don't be trying to dry, honey. Don't be trying to dry. You guys, if you're not following my nail page, go follow it over on Instagram at Deja Lay. I mean, no, I'm lying. I laid it. I'll put it on the screen. Normally, I wouldn't do my thumb, but for the picture purposes, I'm gonna do it. You know, typically, 
when I'm doing a fresh set, um, you have to go in with your dehydrator and your primer. Like I said, these are the ones I use. I just use the Mia Secret dehydrator and the primer. I actually have to get some more, but they last a pretty long time, not gonna lie. Yeah, I would just go in and do that. And then, you know, you always want to make sure that you drill down the nail tips to the natural nail. Like if you feel over when you put on your tips, it's kind of like a little hump. So what you want to do is just make sure that you file without doing it a little, too hard that you burn your natural nail because um, you can mess it up like that. But just make sure that you, um, you know, file down so you won't get any fungus underneath your nails. That's how fungus grows when you allow the monomer to soak underneath the tip. I always make sure I drill and then I'll rub my finger across to make sure there's a smooth surface. And then you guys are gonna see me go ahead and drill the shine off of the tips to make it a not so slippery surface for the acrylic to be laid down. I low key wanna leave them this long, just for picture purposes, cause I really don't wear my nails this long, but I want to be able to show that I could do longer nails. Y'all out here, y'all girls like the longer nails cause you're ratchet, but listen. Ain't nothing wrong with being a little ratchet. I got a client that make me do extendo, 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 and I'll be like, girl! Kinda like hold um, the base of the nail. Cause like I said, this, let me not do it with that one. But like I said, this freaking um, top coat that makes you just peel it off works a little too well. When you're doing nails, it's just like makeup. You gotta trust the process. They look ugly until you get down to the very, very end. You do your shaping, stuff like that. So just trust the process. This might be bad angles for you guys. And I'm, I apologize if so. I'll get better at it. You probably should have be coming from this way because I turned my hand like this. But I can't work like that, it's hard. These are giving me very much coffee. <laughs> Semis. Now that the shaping and stuff is done, you see it, you see it, you see them. Um, I'm just gonna go ahead and drill off the shine on the tips. Like I said, I'm gonna leave alone the blending up here because they're gonna be popped right off anyway. Like this one has a huge hump over here. So now I'm gonna just leave it alone. And I also have to kind of have to hurry up because I have a client after this. And y'all, I don't know why I started this right now, but it's okay. Let's get into the first one. Make sure your brush is super, 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 super wet. Um, I'm gonna have to get a new brush because some of my bristles are like flaring out. And that's because I saw this thing on TikTok and wanted to try it. Like somebody like washed their brush with water and soap and like it just made, made my flare up, so. That was me wanting to be a TikToker and try TikTok stuff. So that's what happens when you want to try TikTok stuff. So when you're doing marbling, what I learned is just to make sure your brush is super, super wet. And just kind of marbling is just kind of, you just let it do what it do, honestly. You just kind of do what you do and make sure you clean up your sidewalls. Keep those all nice. Sorry if you guys can't really see this. I swear, um, I'll get better. This is how it's looking. So I think I'm gonna just do the tips. All right, so I'm gonna just repeat this process on all of my nails. So I'm gonna just speed y'all up real fast. Thank you. 
it took me a long time to learn how to marble and it's really not that hard you guys like it's really not that hard i think i was just looking too much into it got to the point where i can like look from my point of view at the nail and see where like it's lumpy and bumpy so i'm very proud of myself instead of having to like turn turn and check just to get like a smooth surface encapsulated them i'll see how the pink looks on my pinky and then if not i think i'm gonna just do black into like marble okay give me a sec how does that look glitter into marble is that weird <laughs> like i can't tell hold on hold on hold on we're getting somewhere hold on i don't know you know, I don't know. I didn't work all this marble to not be able to see it, you know? Y'all know what? I really don't know how I like this. It's very much so giving like, why? It's giving me that effect. I'm gonna go ahead and drill this off. Comes down to what color do I want on top of this? Which is so stressful and I might've just messed up this nail. It's okay. I mean, hmm. Hmm, should I give it a yellow? Yellow, it's gonna be yellow. Let's give it yellow! Ah! Okay, 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 okay. Okay, 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 let's get into it. Hold on, hold on, hold on, y'all, hold on. Hold on, y'all, hold on. A lot just happened, okay? I had a mini stroke, but you know, we're back and we're better. I'm gonna just put a light layer of yellow. I gotta go ahead and encapsulate that. Trust the process, okay? Trust the process. This is how we looking. This is how we looking. We about to file them down, drill them down, and see what it's given. Oh, my camera's about to die. Dang it. But basically, I'm just filing around my cuticle, and then I'm going to go in and buff it out. And then I'll probably come back to when I'm doing last-minute touch-ups and showing you guys how they look. But right now, I'm going to just finish going around the cuticle with my e-file. And then I'll switch to the hand file, clean everything up. So let me continue this, I'll charge my camera, and I'll be right back. For sure, it was like a trust the process. Uh, trust the process moment so this is how we're looking I don't know if you can see um, the blend is not really doing it for me okay these two actually popped off so it looks kind of weird next to the cuticle but um, I tried to like apply it the best that I can but it does look a little weird I'm about to wipe it off with a non swipe wipe and some alcohol so that's how it will look I don't know if you guys can see let me try something my gel top coat let's bring up the white yeah like i was saying i'm not really sure if i like this so i'm gonna try to add some jewels and stuff some candy what do y'all think some candy will help i have like candies and little bears 
and stuff here. Um, I don't think the bears, maybe if I just put like a bear, a bear will probably do it. That'll have to be a clear one though. So maybe those. Okay, 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 okay. Or should I just do like some jewels? Oh, I wish we were live so you guys could help me. Um, I don't know. Chase, oh, I'm losing bears. I don't even know if I'm gonna like this for real. For real. But we're just gonna get into it. So, you know, if this was like a client or anybody else but myself, of course I would put these on with some um, acrylic. That's what I like to do with all my little 3D type of jewels. I'll put it on with some acrylic so it doesn't fall off. But I'm gonna just use the gel because we're being lazy today. I just need some pictures. I'm not gonna put one on my thumb though. <laughs> I don't really need that. I honestly don't even know if it's gonna stay on with the um, gel. Oops. With just the gel. Okay, it sticks. That's not that bad. Fun fact. I hate polishing nails. Like, it's literally so hard for me and I don't know why. It looks cute, it looks cute. Hold on, I'm gonna I'm zoom in for y'all. Well, I'm gonna bring you closer. Oh shit, I wanna get the band on now. Okay, wait. I'm telling y'all, wait, like, y'all can do something about it. If that man is watching Stranger Things, I'm gonna cuss his ass out. I am not lying. One more. One more, one more. Aw, oh, shit. Okay, I was in there. Oops. I it was long enough for it to like. Damn, that little 10 seconds be getting secured. Okay, that looks, that, I like that, I like that, I like that. Okay, let me put it up in here for the whole like little nine to seconds or whatever. Cuticle oil it. Yeah, that looks so freaking cute. Okay, cuticle oil. I like to put my cuticle oil up to the nub, and then I rub it out on the hands. You really wanna put oil around your cuticles every day when you have a full set. Kinda of just keeps your cuticles nice and fresh, and I'm mad that I just messed up the shine on that one. Grab y'all, let me grab y'all. They be acting crazy. Okay, this is the nails. Like them? I like them, I like them a lot, I like them a lot. They look better in person, not gonna lie to you. But yeah, that's how they look. Um, I'm getting ready to go outside, take some pictures from my Instagram, then go hang out with my babies because he just got home from work. If you guys enjoyed today's video, if you did, make sure you give it a big thumbs up. Um, let me know down below what other nails I should do, it's like ideas, but I am gonna draw out the strawberry nails because I want to do like strawberry milkshake. I have to hurry up. I got somebody coming in. It looked like this. I got to clean up. <laughs> yeah, I want to do strawberry milkshake nails. So I'm going to draw those out tonight and then um, we're going to run it back and I'm going to have a better angles and stuff for y'all. So yeah, if you enjoyed the video, make sure you get a big thumbs up. If you made it this far and you're not yet subscribed, what? Make sure you hit that subscribe button. Follow me on all my other social media accounts. They are down below. Also, follow my nail page at Lay Didum. And yeah, on that note, bye guys! Bye!